This wasn't what was in my account last time. Oh, that is because I added our mutual friend on Nefarious City. Okay. Uh, who doesn't love a day in the sun? Rooting your enemies into the ground with the topiary sprinkler. Spun a turret, then warps your foes into the Getting the pull. Sweet cheeks. Legends tell of a weapon that contains energy so powerful. A beam of it will obliterate enemies with the mere press of a button. And it is called... The Negatron Collider! Obliterate your enemies in a row, or sweep your collider through the crowd. The energy to blast away evil is in. You know you want it. You will definitely want to come back for that. Enter. Got it. May I take a look? I have some experience with dimensional anomalies. I... sure. Hmm. Ah. Ah. Okay. Greetings! Welcome! How did you get in here? Where exactly is, um... Here? Oh, you don't know? Well, I don't either. It appears to be a space between dimensions. Uh, could be nothing. Could be a cascading entropic fissure that will soon turn the entire universe into a formless soup. Time will tell. Oh. Oh, dear. Well, I am Clank. Please allow me to help. Right, yes, Clank. I am the all-seeing cosmic prophet of interdimensional sector 2255 phase Omega. But you can call me Gary. Here we are, Clank. Former warbot, uh, teamed up with the Lombax. Became a hero. Who could for you? Ooh. Ooh, friend of my father. I see. Your father? You might just be the one I've been waiting for. Would you like to help me fix the dimensions? You know how to fix the dimensions? And why are there copies of me running around? They're your possibilities. The key to repairing this anomaly. But first, pick up that nearby sphere. This is a lift sphere. It can reduce the gravity on any object it touches. 
It seems your possibilities are what keeps an anomaly from collapsing. They look like you because that's how you interpret dimensionality. But as you can see, they've lost their way. If you can guide them to the meta terminal ahead, you'll begin to repair this anomaly. Now, enter the meta terminal and you'll be one step closer to fixing this dimensional anomaly. I feel like things are slowly starting to make sense, dimensionally speaking. Ah, a speed sphere! That'll get you moving. Hmm. I bet some extra speed could make quick work of that barrier. Do you live on Sargasso too, Gary? Savali, actually. I've been studying in the archives. It's the greatest repository of dimensional knowledge I've ever seen. device may be able to redirect my possibilities. There must be a way to activate it. some extra speed could help my possibilities cross this gap. I wonder if some extra speed could help my possibilities cross this gap. I wonder if some extra speed could help my possibilities cross this gap.
unnatural at this clank. I am cautiously optimistic. I feel myself learning something by completing these puzzles, but I cannot explain what it is. The words will come to you when you are ready. Now, lead your possibilities to the final meta-terminal. And not to stress you out, but there's a lot riding on this. Like, a lot, a lot. If I fix this anomaly, will that fix all the damage that has been done in this dimension? Oh no, anomalies are spreading too quickly to do that. I'm afraid a dimensional cataclysm is coming, and our only hope to stop it is with that which caused it. The Dimensionator? Indeed. But if repairing anomalies is helping you learn about dimensionality, I think you'll soon be able to learn enough to save us all. Hopefully. I wonder if I will be able to solve all of this in the end. What makes you say that? It has been a long time since I have been a hero. And with everything that happened with the Dimensionator, I am concerned. In times of great stress, which seems to be every day of my life, <laughs> I've always found it best to take things one step at a time. Focus on what's in front of you. Should lighten things up. step closer to stopping the dimensional cataclysm. So then I says, listen, Mort. You, Mort, and Mort better hide that lemonade before Mort shows up. Whoa! You saved them! How did you do that? I... am uncertain. Oh, Rivet! How the heck are ya? Look who it is! <laughs> <laughs> you would not believe my luck today. My trip to Nefarious City went totally sideways. I wrecked my ship, and I... Uh -huh. You go on and leave that one to old Mort. <laughs> well, assuming you brought that part I asked for, hmm? Huh? I'll have this old thing in ship shape. <laughs> Just gotta lower the bridge and then I'm taking you to my hideout. What are we going to do there? You'll find out soon enough.
was within range. We raised the bridge to your hideout for protection, but the controls to lower it are over there on that platform. Thanks for looking out. I'll find a way over. In case you forgot our little sister. My glove thingy can interact with that rift thingy. Your rift tethered, yes. Try aiming at the rift. as well. such a ruckus. regret suggesting this, but what about the speedle? What about it? Uh, almost home! And there's another Grunthor in the way! I do regret this.
locks must be hit quickly. Yep. Morts are funny like that. It appears that these locks must be hit quickly. Yep. Morts are funny like that. with Ratchet. Home sweet home. Why are you so hesitant to trust me? Look, robots aren't really my thing. Especially when they're tearing my galaxy apart. I am not. I was trying to help Ratchet find the other Lombaxes. We'll see the truth soon enough. Once I scan you and the infobot I found in the various city. This is extremely unnecessary. Okay. So, you were being honest. As I have been saying, Repeatedly. You're nefarious. He looks a lot like mine. Evil like him, too. And that Lombax. I know it might sound crazy, but... You think he is your dimensional counterpart. Or something. Look, whatever's going on here, we're gonna fix it. We? I thought robots are not your thing. Not all of them, just most. You know, like the Emperor, his stupid followers, pirates. Yeah, I see the irony too. Oh, I apologize. I did not mean to, um... You feel bad? Even though I just watched your brain diary thingy? Stabilizer should be on its back. If I can get up there and hit it, I can bring the whole thing down.
Seeker Pete's flight stabilizer should be on its back. If I can get up there and hit it, I can bring the whole thing down. until I jump on that thing's back. Unfinished business. Ooh, we should see if Mort fixed up the ship. By the way, how about I hook you up with the signal booster to fix that communicator of yours? That would be delightful. <laughs> Not as thrilling as what we're gonna find in this infobot, but it'll be close. <laughs> 